Leaders just gave the police department a big boost, an extra half million dollars to their budget. KXAN's Mercedes Hernandez spoke with the police chief to find where that money is going. Inside the Huddle Police Department, officers in blue now have a little more green. This community and our city council and our city leadership has prioritized public safety. Huddle Police, Police Chief Jeffrey Yarbrough says the department's budget got a half million dollar boost that money to be used for officer and staff salaries. Officers who elect to work night shifts get a boost as well. It was one of those things that would help with recruiting and retention. Yarbrough says keeping officers isn't an issue, but hiring new ones can be hard. We're not only competitive, we're exceeding some of the uh, salaries that are provided by some of our other law enforcement officers, uh, agencies. Amy Wright brings her grandkids to play at this park in Hutto. And so we just come out and have lunch and we play. Overall, she says she feels pretty safe in the city. So I just feel like if you're if you're in a place by yourself, it's nice to have, you know, a, a somebody watching around there. That reputation is what Yarbrough says this raise will help maintain. One of the things in, in, in law enforcement that I've learned is that when officers who are public servants can come to a place where they feel valued, that is priceless. In Hutto, Mercedes Hernandez, KXAN News. And going in depth on this, this year, Williamson County Commissioners approved raises for sheriff's deputies. Last year,